Hi you guys! Welcome back to my channel and as you all know, this will be my last bubble vlog. Aww. But yes, before we start, I just want to take this opportunity and take this time to really thank you guys for all your support, for all your support for the team, for me, for my vlogs. And I really appreciate everyone who would be so updated with my vlogs, who would um, frequently ask, oh, when's your next vlog at the camp? It just shows how much you actually think my vlogs are worth your time. Anyway, again, from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys. And let's get to it! Hi, so I just moved in this room. And then I'm just gonna do a time lapse of me um, fixing my room and putting <laughs> all the things in place. This is a way of me to not touch my phone. Stores are waiting. <laughs> 15 minutes for ma'am. <laughs> Party <laughs> in my room. <laughs> The whole bubble experience was such a new concept. It's like a once in a lifetime experience. Like, who would have thought we'd have this kind of setup? Like, what? I've experienced that like my whole high school life. We just live in public schools. I wasn't expecting it to be, oh my gosh, like that level. That's so why we facility and all. And it's all thanks to Rubisco, Alaga Rubisco, of course. Any, anything that they can care of, like even our snacks, our food, like even my ice box, and It's like mango, tofu, beef. This is beef. It's really yummy. This is really yummy. Kudos to the management. It was really like exclusive. Nobody else was in that building. It was just like us and of course Creamline. And then my shuttle service came to where we train and super strict Rensala. We trained at I'm not gonna say where. And very away from civilization and our social life. 
which is fine because it's a good setup. Your mind is like all set on one thing, which is winning the PBL championship, which is great. Okay, funny story. Because si Nicole, um, tinatawag siya namin daddy. Because that was my fault. Because roommate ko siya. Tara, pakita natin yung bathroom. Ready? Set, set. Wow. May pa bathtub. May pa bathtub. And then, no first day, tinatawagan niya yung parents niya. And then, sina, parang nini room tour niya na, oh, eto ma yung bathroom namin. Oh, mag say hi ka sa parents ko. Ginaganon niya ako. So, I'm ko, hi, hi. And then, after that, tapos na yung conversation nila. May tumatawag ulit. And then, sabi niya, na, oh, daddy, oh, 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 oh. Ito nga, daddy, oh, oh, magiging kanya na. Busy si Rumi. Ano po, tati, six, seven, two po, no? Uh-uh. That time, I really thought she was talking to her dad. It was her boyfriend. I was like, oh, my boyfriend ka? And then she was like, yeah, oh. Sabi niya, yung palagi ko kinakausap. And then sabi ko, ayun ba si daddy? So yun, yun yung inside joke. One of my favorite memories in the bubble, ito talaga yung core memory ko of the bubble, is like there was a time na we would play Pusoidos every day. I really don't know how it started, but it became like a thing. Okay, at first, mild pa siya, mild, okay pa siya. I mean, wala namang masamang mag card games, di ba? Then it became an everyday thing to an extent na, na pag Saturday, kasi di ba, Sunday walang training. After dinner, magpupusoy kami mga 10, and then we'd end at like 2 a.m. It's all because of Dina Wong. Parang ang galing na mag guilt trip, guys. It's super addicting din kasi whenever you lose, parang you just wanna redeem yourself. Yan lang yung cycle. And I don't know, wala namang pustahan. Hindi ko get. Something about this actually makes me wanna play with them again. Like, oh my gosh, why am I not in the bubble? Why did, did I, why did I retire? Everything that had happened, your major takeaway ko is no matter how strong you are, mentally tough you are, you also need to listen to your body. Yung mga nangyari na okay pa yung mental state mo, yung pinupush mo pa yung sarili mo, pero yun pala yung physical state mo, as in give up na. So you have to listen to that too. So that's my ma one of my major takeaway during the whole league, the bubble experience. Don't look down, bitch! Okay. Memories. 
I also want to touch on my retirement. Um, I want to thank you guys. I can't thank you enough because I wouldn't be the person I am today without the volleyball community. I have decided to close that chapter of my life and move on to my next. In my heart, I feel that I've achieved my goal or I've fulfilled my purpose. I just felt that I needed to move on. I need to be where I can like grow further. I'm moving on to the next chapter of my life and I hope you guys would still support me. You can never take volleyball out of me. It's still part of my life. I'm still a volleyball player at heart. I will cherish all the memories and all the achievements that we had together. And yes, that is it for now. And I'll see you guys on my next vlog. Bye! It's not insane. Ah, oh, no, 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 just, just like this. Front, front, then side. Okay. One, two, three, go. Front, then side. Front, then side. Front, then side. One, two, three, go. Front, then side. Front, then side. Front, then side. Shannon. Yeah. 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 Yeah.